First of all, I have to go back and maybe ask Miss Charles your nationality and the ballet companies you've been dancing with the past couple of years. I'm American. I was born in New York, and I've been in the Hamburg Ballet for 10 years. I sort of started there when I was younger, and that's where I've been the last 10 years. And Mr. Yen? I am born in Czechoslovakia, in France, and uh, I went through the Dusseldorf Theater from Munich Theater, and now since eight seasons I am uh, in Hamburg with Junai Maya. This is both your first visit to Japan, and what are your impressions of Japan? You've enjoyed the nightlife, and what about other aspects of life? Of course there are other aspects, <laughs> uh, but if you want to give good performances, there's not much time, especially for us, which we are not used to your hemisphere, no? such a humidity, and we just jump out from air-conditioned taxi to air-conditioned theaters to air-conditioned hotel, and that's not a right visit. We visited Tokyo, uh, Kyoto, and so about... 12 shrines. 12 shrines, temples, and that was the time when we didn't perform. So, uh, if you want to. In Rio Rio Khan, Khan. Yeah. So Did you enjoy that? Oh, it was beautiful. It Very was nice. really wonderful. We have wonderful pictures for souvenir. And did you take a Japanese bath? Yes, yes. and Japanese dinner and everything. Not, not really the nice. breakfast. Not the breakfast yet. Next time when we come <laughs> in winter time. Especially about Midsummer's Night Dream. Uh, what would you say are the highlights of the piece for the Japanese audience? Uh, well, I don't really want to say. I don't want to give it away. It's better if it's a surprise. I think what's very interesting is there are three different worlds because he used three different kinds of music, Mendelssohn, um, Ligeti. Ligeti, and uh, how do you call that? Um, mechanic pianos, mechanic, mechanical pianos. Like on a music box. Yeah. And those three different types of music represent the three different worlds in the Midsummer Night's Dream. But more than that, I don't want to say. It's Mozart. very funny ballet. Uh, it's very nice ballet. Poetic. Poetic and uh, very funny. And also has three levels of choreography, in a way, of course. Because John always realized the word is to him very important, so he tries to put it in abstract movements. And let's see how, the, how it's going to be in, uh, when we come back and bring the whole production, because it's, of course, uh, more entire and nice. Uh, of course, you can't bring just one dialogue from Shakespeare to get to know the play you bring. Yeah. And tonight's piece, which part of the Midsummer's Night Dream is it from? Yeah, we bring the it's last the wedding. <laughs> the wedding between uh, Hippolyta uh, and Tesois. Thank you very much. We'll be looking forward to that tonight. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much, too. Deva, Lynn Charles san to Ivan Liska san no duetto de Manatsu no yo no yume.
リン・チャールズさんとイヴァン・ディスカさんのデュエットで新しい振り付けによる「真夏の夜の夢」でした。